Catalyst Network, now online. <laughs> Listen up, you unruly lot. <laughs> what I've got here is gonna blow your socks off. It's an email from, now get this, Power Systems. You mean the Power Systems, as in Silicon Valley? The very same. Power Systems International invites you to participate in an exciting worldwide competition. Contestants are invited to submit a 1,000 word essay in text or audio visual format on the subject of future technology. There can only be one winner per country, and the top ten SES will each win... A Power Systems X2000 Super Edition PC! That's sick! Yeah, and check this out. A full-on VIP trip to... Power, Power Systems, Systems in Silicon, Silicon Valley. Valley! Power Systems? They want the hard in hardware! <laughs> this baby's mine. Signed, sealed and delivered. Yeah, I'll remember that when I'm over there hobnobbing with all those cyber celebrities. <laughs> Delusions of grandeur. Sad. Uh, guys... I hate to burst your bubble, but... The contest is only open to your tens. Tragic. That's ageist. Sorry. Come on, Beck. Let's get started. Hello? Remember me? Oh, I'm sorry. It's just I've been waiting a whole month to read this. The true identity of Dark Mirror is revealed. <laughs> Okay, great. Now, give him a bit of room, guys. Okay, now then, let's see. Sign up. What's this? Good. Looks like a coffin. Uh, okay. Guys, is there something we should know? If Dracula's in there, I'm leaving. Don't tell me. It's my new wheels. No, no, it's not. Come on, Alex, you can't fool me. You're feeling guilty about taking my mobile chair away. Funnily enough, no. Come on, Alex, I need to move again. You can wait. Oh, you're right. <laughs> oh. It's Sludge. I had him built cool. for the Trade Expo cool. to promote Refreighter. He'll be huge. So, when do I get my new wheels? <laughs> Guys? Shh. Guys? Okay, okay, Beck, I'm here. What's so mysterious you couldn't tell me downstairs? I checked your email first thing. I knew you couldn't in front of Mike, so I printed out for you. Thanks, Beck. I wouldn't want to be in your shoes when Mike finds out you've been talking to another guy on the net. Oh, oh no! Hey! Hi! Print out another one? Sludge, my man. You're a high-tech guy. What's the perfect essay topic to get me to Silicon Valley? Um, genetic engineering. Ah, it's too wiki. Uh, cold fusion. Nah, it's too cold. Sludge, mate, it's too much pressure with you watching me, okay? I'm gonna go let off some steam. Baby, Mike's the mate. About you and Pi. Tell me if I'm being too personal. You're being too personal, Verge. Okay. What the heck, I'll ask anyway. Have you used the L word with her? Lasagna? Linguini? La, 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 la. Yeah. Verge, <laughs> between you and me, us men, real men, we don't make a habit of saying what we feel, even if we're feeling it. You understand? Ah. So, what, you lie? No, it's, it's not lying, it's just not telling everything. So, it's evasion? No. 
Duplicity? Nope. Guile? No. It, 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 no. But it involves retaining information through deception, and that's cheating, isn't it, Mike? Not in this case, Verge. Do, do you mind? I'm testing. So, Beck, have you um, decided on a topic for your essay yet? Artificial intelligence. Wow! I'll be famous! Shh! It's supposed to be a secret. <laughs> yes! Oh! Can I interview you about it later? Whoa! Yabba jabba! My 15 minutes of fame! I always knew it would come. Hmm. Dear Pie, I've never met a girl like. Virgil? What? Sounds like a love letter to me. Does Mike know about this? Virgil, you don't read other people's emails. It's not nice, okay? Touchy. Artificial intelligence. Shouldn't you be speaking to Virgil about this? I will be later, but I wanted to hear your views first. I mean, you're the only person I know that's created one. I know. Scary, isn't it? So, what are your views on artificial intelligence? In a nutshell, I would have to say that artificial intelligence is the next inevitable step in the evolution of technology. Hold that. That's great, Alex. Mikey, you've got to help me. At this precise moment in time, when I need to come up with a real killer idea, I don't know, buddy, what can I say? The muse just isn't with me. Not a zip. Still, nothing. Why don't you do your essay on artificial intelligence or something, huh? Hey, I, too obvious. Come on, Mike, work with me here, buddy. Any other suggestions? Why don't you do nanotechnology? Cool, classy, very cutting edge. Good idea. Nanotechnology sounds like a winner. Ah! Great, perfect, easy. What is it? OK, home time, gang. I'll catch you guys tomorrow. OK, I'll see ya. See ya, Ram. Bye, guys. Bye, Penny. Bye, Sludge. Whoa! <laughs> gotcha. Boys and their toys. Pi, you drop this. Dear Pi, you really are one amazingly cool lady. Hey, that's personal. Sign, Philippe. Who's Philippe? It's just a friend. How come you never mentioned him before? What? Just because we're together, I've got to tell you every boring little detail of my personal life. Somehow, I don't think this is a boring detail, do you? Philippe? What kind of a name is that? Fresh! Oh, l'amour! Oh, the language of love! Oh, la la. It's OK, Verge. I get the picture. It means I'm sunk. Yeah. Nanotechnology, biomechanics, yada, yada, yada. I mean, I'm never going to make this high-tech stuff sound interesting. What can I say? I'm just not a white coat kind of guy. Mate, we're all out of real anchovies. All I could find was this anchovy paste. Reckon anyone know the difference or what? Vinny, that's cheating. You, you can't take the easy way out. Cheating? Vinny, you're a legend! Ha ha ha! Yes! Child, things to do, places to go, people to see. You want me to go shopping? Shh. Yeah, yeah, on the net. Uh, find me the best essay on nanotechnology that money can buy. It doesn't even have to be written in English, as long as you can translate it for me, OK? From anywhere on the net? Yeah, there are sites that uh, specialise in essays for exams. I know, I know. Aren't they called cheat sites? Sh I'm not sure, but listen, uh, by the way, the other guys, they can't know about this, OK? Well, why not? Uh, well, the thing is, it's... Ah, um... uh, wait. Us men, real men, we don't make a habit of saying how we feel, even if we're feeling it. Yeah, right. Oh, just you wait. You gotta love the guy, eh? No, Mike, she's not here. Like I said before, I haven't seen her since this afternoon. Yeah, I will. Bye. That's the third time tonight. What's going on? I don't think he believed me. I'm not very good at lying. It's not quite my thing. Well, it's my thing. Thanks. Well, I'm not the one avoiding Mike. No, Pi is. Even I can see that. Verge, you're late. Are you ready to answer a few simple questions? Multiple choice or true or false? Both. I much prefer true or false. More concrete, 
For example, it was right telling Mike that Pi wasn't here. True or false? Gee, don't everybody answer at once. Verge, look, I wanted to ask you questions on artificial intelligence. As opposed to what? Human intelligence? Is there a difference? Yes. Apparently artificial intelligence is like you don't make moral choices. Well, apparently neither do you. What do you think about previewing our essays of work? You know, see what the others think, get some constructive criticism. Ah, suss out the competition, huh? No, seriously, I've put together some really hot graphics to go with mine. I was up half the night, so um, how's yours coming anyway? Beck, beck, beck. Yeah, I am pretty tough competition, but you can only do your best, huh? Hot oh, graphics, right. <laughs> Virg. Virg. Quick, need some advice. Virgil. Virg. Hey, wow! You're really? You ran all the way from school. Look, I don't have anyone else to talk to. How do you make a boyfriend slash girlfriend thing work? I mean, last week she didn't trust me. This week I don't trust her. I don't trust Alex. She stole my wheels. Virg, I'm serious. I'm not very good with girls. Although I did go out with the Miss July screensaver program last year. But it only lasted a month. I'll get onto that straight away. Thanks. Bye. Alex, I have an idea. I'm all ears. Well, I thought Marcello and I could put on a show for you and the others. A show? Yeah. We could preview our essays for the competition right here. When I say essays, um, they're more like audiovisual presentations. Actually, when I say audiovisual, they're multimedia in the stricter sense. All right. I think I get the picture. So let me get this straight. You want to take time out from the work that I pay you to do to display something that really you should be doing in your own time. Well, actually, when you put it that way... Of course you can do it. I think it's a fantastic idea. I want you guys to get the best feedback possible. Really? Beck, you think about it. If you or Marcello actually win this contest, how good is Catalyst going to look? Great. Alex, so say if I was to win, does that mean I get a pay rise? Now you're pushing it. <laughs> Thanks. Marcello, you're here. I'll go and round up the others. I cannot wait to see what you and Beck have been working on. Trust me, Alex, you'll be blown away. <gasps> Sounds exciting. Virgil! Hey, Virgil, you there? Virgil! Hello down there! Virgil! Thanks for the essay you got me, but now I need some really hot graphics to back it up, all right? Top shelf, state of the art, really cool stuff, OK? Sounds expensive. I don't care. Graphics, nanotechnology, find some. The best that money can buy, OK? Um, as long as it's under 30 bucks. All righty! Back in a flash. Ready? As I'll ever be. Uh, why don't you go set up? Uh, uh, Beck, actually, I insist. Ladies first, eh? Thanks. And so, in conclusion, artificial intelligence can no longer be looked upon as the stuff of comic books and science fiction. As Alexander Davis of Catalyst Software says, it marks nothing less than the next inevitable step in the evolution of technology. Very nice, Beck. That was great. Well done, Beck. Yes. Beck, that was just fantastic. Honestly, truly inspirational. I think the judges are going to be very impressed. Thanks. Marcello? Yeah? Anything wrong? No, no, nothing. Just uh, getting organised. Huh. At last! At last, uh... At last, uh, miniaturisation has reached a new level. Nanotechnology. Wow, sick graphics, Marcello. Imagine robot doctors so small they can enter the bloodstream, making surgery a thing of the past. Imagine a world where all technology is shrunk to the size of a pinhead spread throughout society. Mini computers, wearable workstations, nanites. The future is 
Nanotechnology. Nice. Congratulations, my child. Yeah, that was unreal. That was wicked stuff, buddy. Jeez, thanks, guys. Yeah, the robotics angle was ace. <clears throat> so it was yours, Beck, really. Uh, I reckon you'll both win for sure. Uh, only one winner per country, remember? Marcello, yours was amazing. You really deserve to win. And I'm sure the judges would think so too. Gee, thanks, Beck. A bit emotional here, guys. Yes, and us men don't make a habit of saying what we feel, even if we have cheated. Uh, what was that? Oh, I can't say. I'm a man. No, no. What was that about cheated? <laughs> I think he's losing a hey! complete circuit overload. The poor guy's crashing. No, I'm fine, really, but buying something from a cheat site is cheating, isn't it? Virgil, you... Ah, uh, see? Marcello's a real man. All that emotion and he can't say a word. Hmm, I think I'll lift the oven on. What? I haven't done anything wrong. I mean, these things are out there for sale. It's legitimate. How could you? It's a commercial transaction. I mean, what's wrong with using the net for research? It's out there for everybody. Have you even researched your essay? Yeah, but Beck didn't try to fob off someone else's work as her own. You'll need tiny robot doctors in your body. Look, it was a business purchase. I've even got a receipt. It's quite cheating, Marcello. Are you going to tell the school about this? Forget the school. Let's email Power Systems and tell them direct. Yeah, cheaters are the lowest of the low. Guys, 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 come on. I think we're taking this far too seriously. Let's just calm down and discuss things calmly, like... Human beings, okay? Come on, guys, hey, never fear, my cello's here, huh? Huh? Save your breath, my cello. Yeah, don't call us, we'll call you. Come on, guys. Mike, wait. What? I understand how you must be feeling. So you're going to tell me where you were last night? Or you mean you understand because last week you didn't trust me? Mike, please, you've got this so wrong. No, no, it's all right. I can't work things out for myself. Like how you wanted to keep us a secret? Now I know. It's because you were seeing someone else. Beck? Go away, I've got an essay to polish. I'm not speaking to you. Why do you hate me? Because you helped Marcello cheat. And, and I don't hate you. I'm just a bit disappointed, OK? And Marcello? I hate him. He's a pig. Serves him right if he doesn't sleep a wink. What's this? The welcoming committee? You don't give up easy, do you? Are you really going to submit that essay? Of course I am. Marcello, listen. It's not just about the contest. It's us. We're part of a team, right? How can we trust you now? If you'd scam us over this, what else could you do? Pick, wake up and smell the free enterprise. In case you haven't noticed, it's a dog-eat-dog -dog world out there. And you've got to grab every opportunity to get ahead with both hands. At any cost. Hey, you snooze, you lose. To think that I actually liked you. She liked me. Beck, I believe congratulations are in order. No way! Yes way. Your essay on artificial intelligence won hands down with the school selection committee. You'll be representing us in the competition. What about Marcello Di Campilli's essay? He withdrew that this morning. But did he say why? No, he gave no explanation whatsoever. Strange kid, isn't he? Um, Pi, um, I'm going to try to say what I'm feeling. Oh, okay, great. 
I've been thinking and considering the circumstances, I think it'll be best if we break up. What? Why? <laughs> You're the one who's two-timing, not me. Okay. Read this. It's from Philippe. No, I'm not going to read that. That's off. Oh, fine, I'll read it. Dear Pi, uh, blah, 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 blah. Now, here, listen. I've never met a girl like you before who'd go to such big trouble for a boyfriend's birthday. Here. What's this? It's Dark Mirror number seven. Philippe's a comic book dealer, the kind that finds the rare ones. It arrived today. Some surprise. Oh, Dark Mirror number seven, this is... What can I say? I'm... I'm... An idiot? Yeah, for starters. <laughs> so, let me get this straight. I didn't tell you the truth up front, so she cheated, but that's okay. Guys. <clears throat> guys. Come on, guys. Hey. hey, wait till you hear what my cello did. Oh, guys, that's disgusting. Disgusting. And yeah, some days you should just stay in bed. Oh well, here goes nothing. Wouldn't get too comfortable if I were you, Marcello. It's your turn to get the pizzas. Yeah, and don't get any little fishes on mine this time, doofus. <laughs> Good to have you back, buddy. So, the contest. How come you dropped out? Well, it's um, not for the reason you think. I still believe that what I did was right. But hey, I just didn't want to lose my friends. Especially you, Beck. Ooh. <laughs> hey, how come no one ever does that to me? <laughs> you think she likes me? Get over yourself, Marcello. It was just a thank you kiss. Yep. She likes me. <laughs> <laughs> guys, guys, guys! It's time! Drum roll, please! Ladies and gentlemen! The moment you've been waiting for, the winners of the Power Systems Worldwide Contest! Oh, I'm so nervous, I can't look. Just, just tell me the countries. Japan, Russia, New Zealand... China, Poland... Chile, Israel... United, United States. States! And the winner from Australia is... Rebecca <laughs> <Rebecca's> from Melbourne! <laughs> <laughs> 